Good day, attorney. I am Denise Ramsaguano. I am Hazel Anairi Bite. I am Rufa Bay Malumay. And I am Mr. J. Arman Sayan, and we are the Lovat Group, and we are here to answer the question number two. So according to the Law of Philippines, Republic Act 3765, also known as the Truth and Lending Act, was enacted to protect citizens from a lack of awareness of true, co- of true cost of credit to the user by using a full disclosure of such cost with a view of preventing the uninformed use of credit to the detriment of the national economy. As a general rule, loan terms shall be disclosed to all types of the borrower for small bis- small businesses, retail, consumer credit. The following are the minimum information to be disclosed. First was the total amount of the total amount to be financed, the finance charges expressed in terms of peso and centavo, the net proceeds of the loan, and the percentage that the finance charge bears to the total amount of the finance expressed as a simple annual rate on or at EIR. For the assigned question, what is the rationale for the disclosure of, of information in the Truth in Lending Act? So the Truth in Lending Act protects the debtor against any inaccurate and unfair credit, billing, and credit card practices. It was enacted by the law to assure full disclosure by requiring the lenders to give the borrower all the details regarding the transaction. It requires the lender to disclose the written important terms regarding the transaction before the borrower is legally bound and pays for the loan. The disclosed statement is required in the, in the transaction contract and borrowers has the right to demand the disclosure of terms. According to Bank of Commerce, the Street in Lending app protects its citizens from a lack of awareness of the true cost of credit to the user by assuring a full disclosure of such costs with a view of preventing the uninformed use of credit to the the detriment of the national economy. So Truth in Lending Act was created to enhance overall consumer protection by preventing lenders from using predatory tactics. The Truth in Lending Act also helps protect vulnerable borrowers like old, older homeowners who can be a target for home equity loan scams by limiting lenders from demanding things like ending a loan early and accelerating balance payments on home equity loans. In conclusion, the rationale of this provision is to protect users of credit from a lack of awareness of the true cost thereof, proceeding from the experience that banks are able to conceal such true costs by hidden charges, uncertainty of interest rates, deduction of interest from the loan amount, and the like. The law thereby seeks to protect debtors by permitting them to fully appreciate the true cost of their loan to enable them to give full consent to the contract and to properly evaluate their options in arriving at business decisions, as stated in new CPB versus Sosib GR number 159912 on August 17, 2017. For the questions, why do you want to become a CPA? The answer was, being a CPA gives me a lot of opportunities and advantages in the path I am in. This profession can give me a job security since when we are trained to be an accountant, we are gaining skills that we can apply to almost any industry of our choice. So for almost or definitely all industries needs uh, finance professionals to help manage and advise them. That is why what I want to become a CPA. So also I want to be a CPA because other than its demandability, they can be suitable to work at any field of business or even in the academe. Also, I have been inspired by some CPAs that I've only met unexpectedly by chance tell me it's like fate. I may have enrolled in this course and plans, but I know that this is the field that I already started to love and been dedicated into. Several reasons why would I want to become a CPA aside from accountants are always in demand. You can work in almost any industry and it is safe It is a safe job to the point that when it comes to money, most people and companies want to keep that as close as possible. And lastly, I want to fulfill my mom's dream and that is to become a CPA. The reason behind why I chose this path is can give me an opportunity to easily open the door to different career paths. Accountancy is a cheap school program yet offers a lot of opportunity. Accounting course can give you job security since you're since the course itself cultivates versatile competencies, which enables you to find employment opportunities and having to experience such difficult as a student makes you to look forward and aim high. And that would be all, attorney. Thank you. God bless. And keep safe.